is up, sexy beast, crazy rabbit here, and today I'm showing you guys how to get the KT4 Wonder Weapon in Zetsuba no Shima. So let's go ahead and get the shit started. So there's three things you're going to want to pick up and then build. So the first thing you're going to want to get is actually, I think, the easiest. So every now and then, a glowing zombie is going to appear, and all you have to do is kill him. This is what he looks like, and sorry I didn't have that much footage, because as soon as he spawned, I was like, no, record, record. So I really didn't get that much footage to show you guys, but this is what he looks like. All you have to do is kill him, and once you kill him, just pick up the drop that he drops. Now the next part's still pretty easy, you can usually get this one fairly early on in the game, so you want to head over to lap A. And once you get over to lap A, you want to have the power on, it could either be the semi power or the full power, it doesn't really matter. Once you have the power on, you want to drop this cage right here. And once you do that, you basically just want to wait for a spider round. When a spider round comes, or if a spider just spawns, you want to take him over here near the cage, he's going to get himself trapped in there, then you want to run back up there and call the cage back up. Once you do that, the drill is going to go inside the spider and I guess produce some spider semen or whatever it's doing. And then once it's done, you know, just come over here to the drill and then hold it square or X and just pick up the part. Fairly simple, just trap the spider in the cage and then call back up and then suck out the spider juices. Now this last one can be kind of tricky, well it's not really that tricky, it's just you really gotta kind of be fast. So you want to come over here down near Mule Kick to the area where you also would get a part for the Pack-a-Punch, and you want to swim to the end, you want to swim all the way to the blue part, so just stay to the right and just follow my path, and you want to go all the way to the end. Now you might run out of air if you do not have one of these little orange pockets of air, pus pockets of air, what are these things are called, unless you have one of these orange jelly things, to shoot, you're probably going to die. So once you get to the end, you're going to see this little flower. Just pick up the flower and shoot this little orange thing. When you do that, you're going to get some more air and you'll be able to make it safely back. If you do not have an orange thing there, say one of your friends shot it already or you already used it and it's not back fully, you're probably going to die. So just swim all the way back until you actually get to one of those areas where you can get some oxygen and then just, you know, keep going all the way back. All right, and once you grabbed all three parts, you want to head outside to, well, to the room outside of Mule Quick. I believe it's called the Operation Room. And you just want to come right over here to this little crafting, ghetto crafting thing, and you just want to hold square or X. You're going to put the gun in there, and it's basically going to make the gun for you, and then you can take it, and then you have the KT4 and go have fun with it. You can use it to your heart's content or until you run out of ammo. So thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully you guys found this video helpful. So if you guys could, please leave a like and subscribe if you have not already. Peace.